Hey, what's up everybody? Ironhead465 here with another video review. Today I'm going to be reviewing Transformers Hunt for the Decepticons Human Light Jazz. Um, this is actually the first movie jazz figure I've gotten. Because as you know, I didn't get any Transformers for the of Fallen and they did not release a jazz figure. The only other jazz figure I have is... It's animated jazz, but I'm really not sure where it is right now. I guarantee you it's somewhere on the floor from me filming. But, uh, yeah. Nice figure. Better than the first movie jazz, in my opinion, from what I've seen the reviews on it and everything. That's what everyone thinks. Now, if they did a G1 repaint, that would be awesome. But, uh, yeah. Here's the stuff. This car mode looks a lot better than the first movie jazz. Which I was thinking it would. It's more detailed. It's got translucent headlights. It's just, it's a better vehicle mode all around. And it comes with this little motorcycle. It loses missile like I do a lot of the times, but uh, yeah, let me just get um, Lennox, the human figure, he comes with, with, hence why they call it Human Alliance, just pull him out. This, by the way, will be used as Spike on my stop motion. Spike will be voiced by Connor Spike 22. Let me just close the door. Uh, let me just close and fold the window to the other side. I did do a little custom blood work on his knee because, well, he's lost surviving human in my stop motion. Of course, he's going to be a little scarred. But, uh, yeah. Uh, for this small of a figure, I think they did do a decent job at capturing the look of Lennox in the movie. I like the guy who um, played him. don't remember his name, but whatever. But, uh, well, from what I remember, Lennox had brown hair. He is, like, more of a dishwater blonde. Night Slash so pointed that out too. Articulation on this guy. By the way, before I show the articulation, this review will probably be split up into two parts due to the fact that I don't want to upload an insane long video and take it me two hours to upload it. But articulation on this figure, his head will rotate 360, which is surprising. His arms will rotate 360 in, out, forward, back, out, and in. Bends at the knee and rotates at the knee. For this small of a figure, that is insanely surprising. Nice job, Hasbro. But, uh, yeah, vehicle mode rolls really well. Doesn't really show any of the robot junk unless you have it transformed where you can see Jazz's head, which I don't, technically. But, uh, yeah. Probably will split this into two parts. Um, let's get down to the transformation for his gun, and then I will show the other half after this. Once I get done transforming this, but you just gotta flip these out. Little parts that cover up the, or is it the oil tank? And you gotta fold this down. And then wait, and then you gotta bend in the wait. I forget. Yeah, you gotta bend in the wheel. Put that down. Fold this little tab out. I got it. And then you have his gun. Okay, part two will be coming. You know, just watch part two after this. So I'll see you.